The world-famous Masai Mara Game Reserve has received a clean bill of health from the British High Commissioner Christian Turner as a safe destination for British tourists to visit. This comes as the county prepares for the annual wildebeest migration spectacle that takes place between the months of July and October. More than 500,000 tourists from all over the world are expected to witness the spectacle that has gained Kenya the fame of hosting the eighth wonder of the world. The envoy re reiterated that travel advisories imposed against Kenya by Western countries was not a blanket warning over the entire country, but rather an advice to their citizens planning on visiting certain areas. He said his government is ready to assist in funding solutions that will, turn help, uh, will in turn help reduce the issuance of the travel advisories. My government is determined and the Foreign Secretary, uh, Philip Hammond, said this when he met His Excellency the President uh, in March, that we must work together against this shared threat. Uh, Britain gives an enormous amount of security assistance to Kenya and will carry on doing that to tackle this threat. Uh, to reduce the scourge of terrorism and eliminate it on Kenyan soil so that we can uh, see those travel advisories lifted and see people coming back uh, to savour the delights that, uh, that, that Kenya has to offer. We all know the importance of tourism in this country. We know that Mombasa have completely collapsed uh, because of security issues and, and, and very soon we'll be having more meetings. Actually, we, we will actually want to call all the Western diplomats in a session with the Council of Governors and thereafter with the President himself and other stakeholders so that we really go to the bottom of it and do what is supposed to be done.